Glug, 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 glug. Where I'm going, there's a dress code. You either wear tight pants and a death metal t-shirt, or you come right here to Victoria Costumes in Brentwood Bay and gear up for Halloween glory. Or should I say, gory. <laughs> if there's one time of year for make-believe, Halloween is the perfect time for us all to create and become our own alter ego. Alter ego, a direct translation from the Latin language of ancient Rome, meaning second self. In fact, Cicero, a first century Roman philosopher, was the first to coin the term, referring to the idea as a friend who could be trusted. Others since then believe that it's a form of identity disorder. What are you gonna do? But for one local entertainer working in the nightclub scene... Are my lips moving? <laughs> he says that it's his many alter egos that make up who he is in real life. It's been going on for, geez, I don't know, seems like almost all my life. Whether it was my buddies calling me a name or me calling myself another name. The man behind the mask chooses to keep his real identity a mystery. He's a local rock legend, having been a drummer in numerous noisy metal bands. The time has come for Zon to take over the hammer! My son! And in 2009, he was destined for greatness. He put down the drumsticks and was bequeathed a hammer by a 1980s Canadian rock icon. John Michael Thor, Thor, the man himself, heavy metal rock warrior. I hope to present a show... Uh, a concert here in Victoria with him. We uh, began talks about uh, inventing a new character. Son Thor and the Metal Avengers were born with timeless music and plenty of theatrics. Show them, my boy. And they're performing at V Lounge for a one night only concert on Halloween night. Hey! So I just want to know, do you actually bite heads off of bats? We do not bite heads off bats, we lop heads off humans. Human brains, feed them to the audience. Speaking of brain, bring me some brain. Oh, just the way I like it, medium raw. Care to have a piece? Love one. Then we can get hammered? Yeah! Yes. <laughs> Son Thor, we meet again. And if I might say so, I feel quite at home in your Roman Colosseum. Oh, and Kim Rock, I might have known I'd find you here amongst this metal mayhem, this rock royalty. Behold the hammer, ride the lightning, hear me roar. They're all just extensions of my own personality, and when it's all said and done, sometimes I've forgotten, hey, wait a minute, I'm wearing an outfit. <laughs> so, you know, as much as I can't say it's not me, I can also say it is always me. Excuse me, are you Zon, the son of Thor? <laughs> Does it look like I'm Zon, son of Thor? You're crazy, get out of here. <laughs> hey man, are you the son of Thor? <laughs> I say, what? And then they almost realize how ridiculous of a question it is, and they take it back. Oh no, I was, I was never mind. <laughs> the Halloween alter egos of Zon Thor and his Metal Avengers will be on full display once again at the V Lounge this Thursday night. And it turns out there's a, a new Thor movie coming out, so it's going hand in hand with Hollywood. From Sanage, in my own adaptation of a grisly Roman gladiator, I'm James Green. <laughs>